Sweden has unveiled its most substantial aid package yet for Ukraine, marking the 15th instance of support with a commitment of 7.1 billion Swedish kroner, approximately 0.63 billion. This latest initiative boosts Sweden's total military assistance to Ukraine to 30 billion Swedish kroner, 2.68 billion, and is specifically tailored to address the urgent military requirements of Ukraine, particularly the significant shortages in ammunition faced by Ukrainian forces. The aid package encompasses 10 strides but 90 fast attack craft, 20 G-class landing craft, Gruppat, and various quantities of underwater weaponry, including mines and torpedoes. Notably, it includes several RBS-70 man portable air defense systems, man pads, BGM-71 tow anti-tank missiles, grenade launchers with ammunition, artillery ammunition, hand grenades, Carl Gustav M4 multi-role anti-tank weapon systems, medical supplies, and medical vehicles to bolster Ukraine's defense capabilities. Furthermore, the package allocates 1 billion sec, 0.9 billion, for the procurement of war material through various funds and another billion sec for the acquisition of new combat vehicle 90s, CV-90s, for Ukraine, with 400 million Swedish kroner, 35.6 million, earmarked for various training initiatives for Ukrainian personnel. Defense Minister Pal Johnson emphasized that the support for Ukraine is not only an act of solidarity but also aligns with Sweden's national security interests. He cautioned that a Russian victory in the conflict could pose heightened security challenges for Sweden. The Swedish government has hinted at forthcoming discussions and announcements regarding additional support for Ukraine. A subsequent press conference scheduled at the Berga military base, featuring Prime Minister Ulf Christensen, Defense Minister Pal Johnson, and Finance Minister Elizabeth Svonesson, underscores ongoing deliberations on Sweden's contributions in light of the situation in Ukraine.